Why do I buy the S&P 500 index every month without fail, regardless of the price? Why do I do that? I do that because I have looked at the long-term real returns of the S&P 500 index for a long period of time, and it's very convincing when I look at it. However, to look at that and get the right idea, I have to look at it the right way. I even have to look at it on the right kind of graph. Okay, if I look at it on the wrong kind of graph, I'll get mixed up. I won't get the right idea. So here's this data that goes from 1791 all the way to 2025. This is the S&P 500 total real return. That is, we have taken inflation and considered it here and removed it. So this is real return. This is real value. Okay, for the S&P 500 index for the last 232 years. And you can see the pattern here. Okay, it's a straight line. It's fantastic. It's amazing. All kinds of stuff has happened during that period of time, yet the equity market has surged upward at a consistent 6.2% per year on average, according to the trend line fit that I'm showing you there. Okay, yes, there have been lots of bounces up and down. That's right. Okay, but still, there's clearly a pattern there. Okay, that I'm looking at that data and I'm showing it to you right now on a logarithmic plot. A logarithmic plot is a plot where on this vertical axis it goes 1, 10, 100, 1,000, 10,000. It grows by factors of 10. Not 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, like the graph that you learned about in algebra class. Okay? This is what that same data looks like on a linear plot. You see it? Does that look anything like what we just saw? It looks completely different. Okay, if I looked at this plot and I didn't know any better, I would say nothing happened until 1950, and then after that, everything has gone completely nuts and gone up so much that it's over. I've missed it. Look, nothing happened. Everything must have started in 1950 or 60, something like that. Baloney. That's not right. It's just buried in the linear, the way the linear plot works, it can't show the change over the long term. It can't show the change over that many orders of magnitude. Let's look back at the logarithmic plot. There it is. There's the consistency. That's why I buy it. Okay, but we got to look at it the right way. Remember that. Oh, by the way, the line, the line on a logarithmic plot, that means exponential growth. Very important. You have to remember, the stock market grows exponentially. It doesn't grow linearly. All right? Got to think exponentially here. Okay, I hope that is helpful, and see you next time. Don't think, don't blink.